Hey everybody, today we are talking on Kanye West. He calls out fake Kim Kardashian diarrhea post and mocks Pete Davidson again. As he continues to furiously post to social media. Let's watch further details in this video. Hit like and share with your friends. As Kanye West continues to post non-stop through Labor Day weekend, he took a moment to clarify a doctored post about Kim Kardashian and her bathroom habits. The mogul shared a viral post that was made to look like it came from him but, in fact, did not. He reshared the post, writing along with it, This was not from me. Someone copied my style of text and wrote something not funny. On Sunday, Yi shut down a meme that read, Kim has diarrhea a lot. Like way more than a normal person should have it, covering his ex-wife's name with a thick pink smudge. As he shared it to his Instagram account sandwiched between an onslaught of other posts, he set the record straight that it was not him who wrote it. The music artist took the opportunity to clarify another post that was misunderstood to have been written by him. He added in the caption, I know you guys gonna be disappointed but I actually didn't write the teat that said, friends wasn't funny either, but I wish I had I'd love to know who thought of that I like to post comments. He went on, without using any punctuation, cause you all beep is hilarious I love funny people and I think that's one of the reasons me and Skete could have never been friends, throwing in a dig at Pete Davidson. Then the father of four listed his go-to comedians as he added, Comedically some of my favorites are me Mitch Hedberg Anthony Jesselnik Louis C.K. Jared Carmichael DeRay J.P. Smooth Maze Elon Musk 50 Justin LeBoy GLC Eddie Murphy Sakia Sandifer Chris Rock Larry David Kevin Hart in Jumanji, and of course King David Dave Chappelle. He wrapped up the caption by explaining, I like to fight with jokes sometimes we gotta laugh to keep from crying even when we dealing with serious topics. Beep be the funniest when it's true that beep that commented on my outfit really does work at Universal Daniel Cherry Pop really wore that hat, he ended, referencing a previous post he made about the Adidas executive. But before exclusive details, please subscribe our channel, hit bell icon, and I'm sure it helps you to watch what we are watching. It comes after West updated his followers about the state of things between him and Kim as they argued over their children's education. On Saturday he revealed he had a good meeting with his ex after furiously posting screen grabs of his back and forth with her over where their children should attend school. But when he fired up his Instagram this weekend he wrote, Hi guys I'm back sorry to take so long to post I just had a good meeting with Kim about the schools. He used the rest of his caption, however, to continue bashing a slew of enemies, including Adidas executive Daniel Cherry, Kid Cudi, Pete Davidson, and more. The rapper turned designer publicly declared a feud with Adidas, whom he's partnered with via his Yeezy empire. Additionally, he added fuel to his fallouts with Cuddy and Davidson. Directing his furor at Cherry, Adidas senior vice president, general manager, he let off a slew of threatening and angry messages. In one of the posts he shared a doctored image of Cuddy and Cherry standing side by side with an Adidas logo pasted on each of their chests. He joked that, I'm sure this pic gonna send Adidas stock through the ceiling you're welcome Jing Ulrich who is on the board at Adidas and JP Morgan so it makes sense now that when I wanted to sail JP Morgan went silent. In line with his previous posts, the caption consisted of one long run-on sentence with grammatical and spelling errors, making it difficult to wholly discern. Set against a black background, he typed in all capital white letters, I guarantee you'll have to relocate before I'm legally finished with you. West called the executive a venture capitalist who's sick. Only adventure is capitalism, continuing, can't create so they try to outcount the creatives. Die slow. In a separate but equally upset post he added, beep VC. Now what? Yes frustration stems from feeling left out of managing the Yeezy Gap brand he helmed. Thanks for watching and thanks for your precious time. We hope that you found this story interesting. Please comment your views down in the comment section. Share this story with your friends and we'll see you next time.